Hey, it's Danny from Conscious Calisthenics here. So a lot of people keep asking me on my one year calisthenics body transformation video is what diet was I exactly eating whilst transforming my body within that one year period. And if you haven't seen my one year transformation video, I'll put a link for it up above so you can go and check that out. So yeah, at the start, I first was doing a diet known as the 16-8 intermittent fasting diet, where you fast for around 16 hours every single day, and you can drink certain things such as black coffee, but I was just doing it on water only, and then you eat for around an eight hour window. But what I say is, I was fasting anywhere from 16 hours to 20 hours, sometimes more, every single day day and I was doing that for over half of the year transformation that I did with my body and calisthenics and the type of diet that I was eating with the 16-8 intermittent fasting diet method was a plant-based vegan diet and I still eat that type of diet now but what I say is when I was breaking the fast I was normally having a big big fruit smoothie so it would be around a quart and a half to two quarts in size. And it would normally consist of mangoes and bananas, a garden of life protein powder. I'll put a link down below for it in case you're interested in that. It's the best protein powder on the market, whether you're vegan or not. It's infused with enzymes and probiotics. It's really easy to digest. And it's very, very nutrient rich with micronutrients as well. So it's really, really good. Um, healthy protein source that's going to help optimize your mind and body holistically health wise but also help give you the protein you need to build muscle and help your muscles recover as quickly as possible and then I'd normally add water to it or some organic soya milk and then once I'd have that meal a few hours later I then have a cooked food meal which normally I was eating the same foods over and over again. So I'd normally at home cook things such as potatoes with lentils and peanuts and broccoli and carrots. So yeah, I was having very, very high carbohydrate plant-based meals with no refined carbs whatsoever, no packaged processed crap either. So I was eating a very, 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 very healthy, clean diet. And I was normally eating around 3,000 calories or so. So quite a reasonable amount of calories. And yes, I was having a moderate amount of protein in my diet. And it would be anywhere from, let's say, 50 grams to 100 grams, depending on the foods I was eating. Because sometimes for my dinner meal, I'd have an oat meal uh, dinner that would have so many oats in and protein powder in it and peanut butter and loads of protein based sources in so when I was having the oatmeal it would go up to around 100 grams a day including the smoothie that was giving me additional protein as well but then over time I started to slowly go towards eating one meal a day and I still eat one meal a day until this day and yeah the difference between the 16 and 18 intermittent fasting method, the one meal a day, is literally I eat one meal a day, and what I would normally do is eat a small amount of fruit, some freshly made juice or some coconut water to break the fast, and I'd normally fast around 22 hours to 24 hours every single day on water alone. And the reason why I'd eat the fruit first or a juice would be to allow my digestion to slowly wake up. And then once it wake up, I go out and eat three to four thousand calories of cooked food. And I was always eating at restaurants, never making home cooked food. So when I switched to one meal a day, it was completely different. I was going out and eating vegan cakes and cookies and vegan ice cream and curries and Mexican food and waffles, pancakes. Like you name it, I was eating it. It was still relatively high carb, but definitely with more fat in and a bit more protein as well. And yeah, I found that switching from two meals a day to one meal a day, I just felt a lot better overall holistically. And I found once I made that switch, that my body fat percentage significantly reduced. And if you're someone that doesn't know the benefits of intermittent fasting, the reason why 
I started fasting daily and started doing it for longer periods of day and switching to one meal a day is the longer you fast, the greater benefits you get from daily intermittent fasting as proven through scientific research. So the benefits you get is a massive increase in testosterone and science has shown that it increased anywhere from 200 to 400%, which is amazing. Human growth hormone in men goes up by about 2,000% and in women about 1,300%. It also massively drops insulin and improves insulin sensitivity. It also gets your body to produce a protein known as glucagon, which this protein allows your body to burn its own body fat as fuel. So all of these benefits are known to massively increase muscle mass, make your muscles recover quickly, but also reduce your body fat as much as possible. And as many people know, so many people in the fitness and bodybuilding industry, especially at the high level like pro bodybuilders, they normally take synthetic insulin, testosterone, which some people know as steroids, and human growth hormone. But this is the best natural alternative that is completely free and completely safe at the same time without any side effects whatsoever. Ever. So yeah, it's something that I really, really highly recommend to people. If you want to get a ripped muscular physique, intermittent fasting allows you to do it very, very easily. And you can eat whatever you want on any type of diet. You don't have to eat the plant-based diet that I'm eating and you will still get the same results from what I've seen with people that I've helped and coached around the world and what I've seen from other people that I've looked at testimonials online that have done this daily intermittent fasting. So yeah, I find it's the ultimate weight loss hack that helps you just get a very, very ripped physique and gets you to have a very, very visible six pack if that's what you're looking to achieve. So yeah, it's something that I really, really highly recommend to people. If you wanna get a ripped muscular physique, intermittent fasting allows you to do it very, very easily. And you can eat whatever you want on any type of diet. You don't have to eat the plant-based diet that I'm eating and you will still get the same results from what I've seen with people that I've helped and coached around the world and what I've seen from other people that I've looked at testimonials online that have done this daily intermittent fasting. So yeah, I find it's the ultimate weight loss hack that helps you just get a very, very ripped physique and gets you to have a very, very visible six pack if that's what you're looking to achieve. And for anyone wondering what macros was I having, I was rarely ever, let's say like 2% of the time, I tracked my macros, but I was never trying to hit a certain amount of protein, fat, and carbohydrate macros every single day. I've tried to do that in the past and count calories and it just drives me absolutely mad. I roughly know how many calories that I was eating because I sometimes just work it out in my head and I could estimately work out how many I was having. But yeah, I was never really weighing up my food and working that all out. All I was doing was eating as much food as I possibly can, sticking to a plant-based diet that was high in carbohydrates and just allowed my diet and my training to give me the body that I dreamed of and the fitness levels and the energy levels as well. And yeah, if you're someone that wants to learn about switching to a plant-based vegan diet, do your research up online, there's loads of resources free. And if you'd like me to make any videos on this subject, then let me know. And what I'm gonna do is put a link for a playlist up above where I show you in so many different videos exactly what I was eating at restaurants and other different places as well. So you can see exactly how much food I was eating. A lot of people are very shocked when they watch my videos and see how much I eat because I was eating so many calories in one sitting. A lot of people get shocked because they don't believe that you can eat a lot of calories and get a physique like I have managed to and sustain it long term, especially without the use of drugs or other substances so to speak, to strip body fat and increase muscle mass in a synthetic, unnatural way. So that's it for this video. If you have any questions, leave them down below. I'll get back as soon as possible. If you like the video, like it down below, give us a thumbs up, and please share this video with anyone that you think would love to learn about what diet I was eating to transform my body within one year with calisthenics and actually gain 10 kilos of muscle within that one year period and help me actually gain and maintain the physique that I truly had dreamed of for a very, very long time. And yeah, I'm so grateful to be at that point where I actually have the dream body that I desired. And it took me a lot of hard, consistent work, but if I can do it, you can do it too. Don't let anyone else let you believe or try and get you to believe that you cannot. Just put in the hard work, be consistent, be disciplined, and you will get there. And if you're someone that would like to receive a lot more videos from me on a regular basis, make sure you click that subscribe button down below to receive a lot more videos where I'm talking about all the different things that I did to transform my body within one year with calisthenics and specific plant-based diet. Also many videos that are informational videos on eating one meal a day, intermittent fasting, calisthenics, workout and progression videos and many other different videos to help you go in the direction of gaining and maintaining the body inside the fitness levels and the energy levels and teach you the information to get there as well. So if those type of videos sound good, 
YouTube, make sure you click that subscribe button down below and you click that bell notification button next to the subscribe button. Otherwise, YouTube will not notify you of when new videos are uploaded. And I have new ones coming almost every single day. So as always, stay fit, stay energetic, and go get those gains. Peace.